Hey guys, so um, I'm in the process of testing speakers. Uh, when I finalized and went with the 24 mil bass speaker, which is in all my sabers, I, uh, I went through about 20 different speakers. It took me oh, four, four, maybe six months. Uh, and it cost me at least a hundred pounds minimum before I came to this speaker and I tested them all and this was by far the best speaker I've ever ever found. Um, I'm in the process of developing a full in chassis crystal reveal uh, uh, hilt uh, chassis and uh, it, I wanted to take the opportunity to test out a 28 mil inch sorry 28 mil uh, speaker uh, this is one of the very high-end bass speakers it's one that's been recommended a number of times it's what it's the one that goes in some of the more expensive high-end savers that you get uh, and I wanted to see is this better than mine uh, am I doing something wrong should I be moving over to this speaker in the new shashi new new sashi shashi shashi the new setup I'm doing I can't say chassis. Oh, there we go. I said it. I have trouble with that word. Um, what I'm going to be doing is I am going to be using my phone to record as well because I've done this a few times. Uh, the quality of the mic, um, it's it's not particularly great. Uh, it doesn't sound fantastic and it doesn't really convey the real effect of these speakers. So um, I will record the video and then I will do, uh, I'll play the video, uh, the first test. I will then jump to the 28 mil. And then I will give you the sound file from the phone as well. Or maybe in that order, I don't know yet. It might be a case that I play it through this speaker and then go straight to the phone recording uh, and then do the same with the other one. So we'll, we'll see. I think, I think I'll try and keep them by, side by side anyway. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use the battery. This is just a standard 18650 battery that I use with a PCB protection on it uh, for safety. So I'm just going to put that in there. Just need to put the speaker inside. And just so you know, I am trying to make this test as, as possibly fair as I can. Uh, I'm not trying to uh, give any or one speaker uh, a greater chance of being impressive. Uh, I'm trying to do this as equally as possible because I actually want to know is it worth God, give up? Is it worth upgrading? Okay, so it's so frustratingly annoying sometimes. So the, that speaker is going to be in quite some way. It's quite hard to see. Um, but it's at least two centimetres inside, which I think is more than adequate. Okay, so I am going to make a loud, I'm going to start recording on my phone. I'm going to keep this about here because I think that's adequate. And you'll see that these are both basically lined up. So. Force Saber on. Okay, so that was test one. I'm now going to go to test two. Uh, well, I'm going to try the second sound font, not the first. New Horizon. The Dark Sword. So this is the Dark Sword.
Okay, I'm not going to move this around. It's still in the same place. Just, yeah. It's still the same point of the inside. So it's, okay, it's now th nearly three centimeters inside. Uh, second profile. The assassin. The knight. Okay, right, so, um, it was okay, uh, I'm not, I wouldn't, if I, if that was the sound quality I got with a, a lightsaber, I wouldn't be upset, I'm now going to try my own custom one, uh, just as a side note, this metal grill inside, do, uh, don't push that in or you'll break the speaker, but I'm going to give this a go now, this has got the 24mm bass speaker in, which is what I use all the time. Uh, and I'm trying to keep this as completely fair. Yeah, that, that seems fine. I'm trying to keep this as completely fair as I as I possibly can, um, so that that they really do have a chance. So. Okay, um, yeah, so this one is in that far, and I know the other one was in further. Um, if I was to get this speaker in a lightsaber, uh, I wouldn't be disappointed, uh, it'd be adequate, it'd be fine, um, 
there's nothing wrong with it whatsoever um, I don't think the overall output quality is as good as the 24mm bass speaker very very close there's, there's a number of times through those testings where they were both very very close uh, or this was very close to the 24mm bass speaker uh, it it didn't really perform as I had hoped with the lower bass notes um, it was a bit more grinding on the ears uh, on the high end notes the mids were fine uh, it was nice it was clear um, the, the speaker was around about when it came out and I pushed it back in the speaker is about there whereas the other one has been about here all the time so this had more resonance than the other speaker um, for one of the top end speakers you can get for lightsabers I am uh, in a way I am disappointed I, I thought the bass would be a lot better a hell of a lot better than it is uh, I thought the top end notes would be crisper uh, I think it, I thought it would manage that more uh, the mids fine absolutely fine on the mids no no issues there whatsoever um, but if I was to give this a rating out of 10 10 being the best uh, I would I would definitely give this an absolutely solid 6 out of 10 uh, and I would be very happy saying that it's a very good seven um, now just bear in mind I've got two different mics here this one isn't great this is the much better um, mic because it's on the mobile phone uh, so it gets the low end and the high end better um, but again depending on the device you're watching this on if you're watching this on a TV um, it will sound different to you listening to on your phone uh, if you're listening through a TV surround sound completely different result again uh, if you're not in a completely quiet room fair enough uh, the only way you could really get the true representation of how it sounds or as close to as would be to uh, put some earbuds in uh, and or earphones and actually listen to it that way um, with the 24 mil speaker the bass was much more impressive much more impressive uh, it was much clearer in the bass it was much more meaty in the bass um, I, I can't fault the bass on that all the low ends were absolutely fantastic uh, the high ends were just as good as the 28 mil speaker the, I don't think the 28 mil speaker surpassed this in any way in that sense overall uh, that one was fractionally louder it was able to output slightly uh, higher volume uh, than this one but if I got this in a saber and or that one I wouldn't really know and I wouldn't be disappointed with either either one uh, the mids were absolutely fine and in fact I think I'd have to say the mids were slightly better than the other one it was slightly clearer uh, and the bass was definitely much clearer to hear um, so if I were to rate this one and bear in mind I've gone through a lot of different speakers to find the best ones I can for the Sabres if I was to rate this one bear in mind this was a six bear in mind that the 28 mil one was a, a six a solid six uh, and a very good seven I would definitely have to say that this is uh, still when I well, first time I did it uh, this is a, a solid eight uh, and uh, a very good uh, very good nine so I think I'm going to stick with these uh, now I appreciate it may sound very very different to you um, when you watch this um, but I am being completely honest I'm not being biased um, if this was the best speaker I would start using it uh, for the in the chassis for the primary reason these chassis are going to be the most top end that I can produce I'm not saying they're the top end in comparison to other sabers 
they are going to be the top end, the very best of what I have in these these new sh product chassis I'm going to do. And for for that reason, I am going to go with this uh, because this has overall the very best quality uh, that I can find out of the two. So yeah, um, like I said, don't go anywhere. I'm going to put the comparisons on next, and you can you can see and ju judge for yourself. See you then. Force saber on. So this is the Dark Sword. This is the Dark Sword.
Uh, so that's the end of the video guys um, uh, I got to listen to a lot of the sound samples as I was editing it the sound quality through the mic was actually a lot better than I thought it was going to be uh, this is like the fourth or fifth time uh, God knows how many times I've done it now um, but uh, the first few times the speaker was, that was much closer to the speaker and it was terrible uh, it seemed like I got the right distance this time um, the sound quality on the phone uh, the recording on the phone recording on the mic was really good um, I think it portrayed a very good uh, reflection of how it sounded um, and I'll be honest going through it side by side they're so incredibly close but I still stand by what I said originally in the start of the video uh, I still think the bass speaker is the uh, is the better speaker to go with so that's what I'm going to stick to uh, I hope you like this video I'll try and bring out some more soon